this. I'm trying to, there's these bloody geese were just on the road. I'm trying to go pick the boys up. Hey, do you guys know where I can find the top shop? Whatever. Stop, 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 stop. Okay, hang on. It is at this point in this vlog episode that I need to point out that in my um, previous episode I did not use the correct grammar. Um, Anna Donald has kindly pointed out that I, I did not use possessive apostrophes. If you look um, here, where are we? there, there's a, uh, should be an apostrophe there, and also there should be one up here under let's. Okay, so I am now, I am now going to fix that moving forward. Okay, thank you. It was uh, pointed out to me that my first vlog episode was too long. It was nearly 10 minutes. Um, and the average attention span of someone watching a video nowadays on YouTube is around about a minute and six seconds. So I'm gonna try and keep them compacted now. Under five minutes like that. Uh, and I will also only have one segment in. So um, today's segment is um, ask me anything. You can ask me anything, bro. And it's uh, basically a mate of mine um, saw my first vlog episode that a guy used to work with in London and he just asked me a question. So, um, hey, roll the intro. So, my friend John Deck asked me what it was like post working with him in IT support in London in 2001. So, basically, in 2001, I was working at a law firm in, in London, that's me in 2001, in London, and um, yeah, so basically post that, John, this is what happened. In 2003, I met and fell in love with possibly the most beautiful, smart, talented, funny woman on the planet, in the galaxy, in the universe, and everywhere else. Helena, I hope you're watching. Then in 2004, I switched industries and became a video editor. And my first job was editing soft adult based content. That should actually say soft adult based content, not just adult based content. It's not porn. It was more like, uh, you know, kind of wholesome porn. It was girls running around with their tops off, stuff like that. So not really anything nasty. Okay. Then in 2005, what happened then? Oh, I moved back to New Zealand. That's right. With Helena. Thank you. Then in 2007, uh, we. What happened then? So, oh, that's right, yeah, we bought a house in East Coast Bays. Then 2008, uh, that was a big year. Uh, 2008, we got married. Got married twice, actually. Once in New Zealand and once in France. That was awesome. And uh, then, two, yeah, also, yeah, okay, had open heart surgery. Don't recommend this to anyone, okay? Really sucked. Um, you wake up in the morning, you've got tubes sticking out of you. You feel like hammered. Uh, really sucks. I do not recommend it at all, okay? Okay, and then 2009 was another good year because it was the birth of our first son, Felix. Um, he was a tiny little bugger. He was only, I think he was like 2.3 kilos or something like that. So he was just about at that kind of weight where they take you away and start you know, doing tests on you and sucking all your blood out of you and putting, you know, things in all your orifices and all that sort of stuff. He, but he was just on the border of it, so he didn't have to. So that was sweet. I also started an acting course, got myself an agent and started doing some mean, hardcore, next level acting. 2010, uh, what happened then? Oh yeah, I changed industries again, switched industries, and this time became a web geek. Started doing web hosting and web development. In 2012, the birth of our second son, Oki, Oscar. He, um, he was, yeah, he was awesome, uh, yeah. 2015, which is now, started an e-commerce business. So, selling products online on Amazon with a view to basically dominate uh, and take over the internet and the world and everything. Awesome, bro. That's it. That's all I've been doing. Uh, yeah, so so I guess, John, to answer your question, apart from those things I just mentioned, not really much has changed, bro. You know what I mean? See you later. Yeah.